When I first started working in the garbage industry, it was in 95. It was good because it taught me what men go through out there every day, picking up trash. The first thing we did was to create slinging two cans in the air, dumping them at once. Then they started, okay, well, shit. I know I gotta run back over here to this house. Say like 15, 10 yards. Save myself some time. If I can throw it back over there to the house and make it stand up, everybody gonna, damn, be good. I dump a can with this hand. Or oh, I throw it in the air with this hand, catch it with this hand and dump it and flip it back over my head and it's fine. Somebody's gonna try to do the same thing. I set a trend, really. But there are a lot of the things you see, and I'm talking, I'm not telling you a lot. A lot of the things that you see, that people see these hobbies do on this West Bank, they got that for me. I'm serious. I tell you, anybody can be made to become a friend if you treat them with kindness and respect. And garbage people helps people understand that. It don't matter what color you are, we're all the same. And if I give you my respect, you're gonna respect me. I don't care if you can hate the rest of the world. You're gonna like me. One lady said, I'm 40, no, I'm about to lie. She said, I'm 87 years old. And out of all the years of my life, I've never had a garbage man bring my can back. I said, baby, you ain't never gonna meet a garbage man like me.